angle properties of a circle. In the figure below, the tangent ST meets chord VU produced at T. Chord SW passes through the center O of the circle and intersects chord VU at X. Line ST is equal to 12 cm and UT is equal to 8 cm. Question number 1. Calculate the length of chord VU. 2. If WX is equal to 3 cm and VX ratio XU is equal to 2 is to 3, find SX. So the diagram is there. All the labels are given, all the measurements are given. The only measurement that is not given there is uh, WX, which is here, which is uh, 3. This is uh, 3. WX is 3 there, as you can see. So let's go to the first part of the question where you're supposed to get VU. Now, when you look at VU, you need to think of the property that you're going to use in order to assist you to get uh, that length. Properties of chords. Now, when you look at uh, ST, ST is a tangent and VT is a second. So, automatically, you're going to use uh, this property, the tangent second property. So we're going to extract the tangent second property from the figure that you have there. So tangent ST and second VT. VT multiplied by UT is equals to ST squared. That is the property that is going to assist us. Now, ST is given is 12. What we don't have here is VU. So we can let VU be X. Now we can write the property. So VT, if VU is equals to X, therefore VT will be X plus 8. Then multiply by UT, UT is 8. That one should give ST squared. ST is 12 squared. So, working out this, you get uh, 8x plus 64 is equal to 144. So, when you work out here, you get 8x is equal to um, 80 and x will be 10. But remember what is x? x was vu. So, vu therefore is equal to 10 centimeters. So, that is how you get vu. Now, from there, uh, VU is the solution in the first part. Now let's go to the second part of the question. Now the second part of the question is whereby you are required to get um, you're given this ratio VX XU is 2 is to 3 find the SX. Now again you need to think when you look at that question what property is going to assist you. Now the property that you're going to use there is the property of the intersecting chords we shall extract the intersecting chords property from the figure and the intersecting chords are sw and vu those are the intersecting chords so the property that you're going to extract is sx multiplied by wx is equals to vx multiplied by xu we need to get these vx and xu we need to get vx and xu and um, looking at this ratio that is given there, um, that will assist us. So we already have VU. VU is the one that is being divided into that ratio, 2 is to 3. So to get VX, we are going to use this ratio. VX is uh, 2, will be 2 thirds multiplied by 10. Because the, the whole length VU is 10. This uh, is going to give, um, this is 2 over 5. Sorry for this. So this one should be 2 over 5 since the ratio is uh, 2 is to 3, the total 2 plus 3. So this one should give um, 4. So Vx is 4. Then to get uh, Xu, Xu will be, Xu will be 3 over 5 times 10. And this one will give um, 6. So x u will be 6. So you've already got a vx is 4 and uh, x u is 6. We have used this ratio 2 is to 3, having that length vu. 
now we can write so sx which we don't have multiply w x is given as 3 is equals to vx vx is 4 multiply by x u x you've got it that is a 6 so this one should give uh, as the value of sx so to get sx we simply need to take to, uh, 4 multiplied by 6 divided by 3 and this one should give 8 centimeters and that is simply how you're supposed to get that length sx so we've got the first part vu we have it vu is 10 centimeters which assisted us to get the second uh, part of the question that is uh, sx